So you're looking for an easy way to get sight square on your sight out of your laser. You might have seen the videos on the CX510SS that does the auto tracking and vertical to give us a nice easy sight layout. We also have there the auto tracking base, which you can use with the line laser you may already have. So that auto tracking base will talk with that receiver, will pick up both red and green beam lasers, um, and again, auto track around to lock into the receiver. It will operate with our 3L360 range. The negative with those is they don't, they don't rotate on their central plumb axis, so they're probably not the ideal laser for that. Whereas these style of lasers all have a vertical plumb down and they rotate on that plumb point. So if we look at that with the Unilevel ULN59, it's four vertical lines. If we um, take off our adapter, attach that to our laser, level our laser, turn on the verticals, put it into pulse mode, stick it on our tracking base. We can put our tracking base onto our receiver and then power on that auto tracking base, which I've done there. Make sure those lines are on. And pulse mode. With the um, receiver, we turn on our receiver, press the auto track, put it down over our mark, and direct the laser around. The laser is going to track around, talk to the receiver, and track itself in. So that's a class 2 red beam laser. That receiver is going to pick that up up to 50 metres away. Uh, we can track within 15 to 18 metres and once it's um, tracked it will lock on so we're just about there, I can see it coming in so now that's locked on we can now pick up a right angle to the left, to the right or behind so we've got our sight square on sight without the need of a 345 and in, not without concerns of wind. So as I said, that will work with both a red and a green beam. So I'm just going to, out of curiosity, remove that laser. We'll stick that over there. Just aim it, just to give you an idea of the difference in intensity. You can't even see that red beam there. We're now going to attach it to the XLG44 green beam laser. Again, power it on. Now this is electronic levelling, so it gives us twice the accuracy over our pendulum levelling lasers. We're going to turn on all of our vertical beams. It's already in pulse mode. Just tighten that on. Again, our auto track base is turned on. So there's our class 2 red beam. There's our class 3 green beam. I'm going to bring it over so it doesn't interfere with that red beam. Turn on the auto track, bring the laser around. You see that scan around. Again, that receiver is going to be talking to our base and it will um, talk itself in. Again, outside, we're going to get up to 50 metres with that receiver in broad daylight. Tracking 15 to 18 metres, again, broad daylight outside. So, that combination of that auto tracking base, electronic levelling laser, you can see it's constantly levelling as that's tracking around and, we, and we're not seeing the movement, it's a rapid level, electronic levelling laser. But that combination of the XLG44 and that auto tracking base is absolutely a fantastic combination. Um, all ideal for fit out, tiling, outdoor, site square, whatever you want from that point of view. Anyway, got any more queries, give us a call, 1800 769 858. Or just click on the buy button.